two stone, give me one good right in the gut. Come on, give it your best shot. What? What are you talking about? I want everyone to know who I really am. Me being me. This baby's hard as a rock. Certainly, I was made to be the rock. Ugh. Prudence, I don't have a clue what you're talking about, but I do know that the Lord did not create you to be a rock. He gave you some wonderful talents. Uh, for instance, you're one of the most expressive people in, in our whole choir. I love the way you always let everyone know what's going on with you. And that's nothing to sneeze at. We're back already, Mr. Stone. With several of us working together, we had Ruby's flowers planted in no time, and they look great. They sure do. My mom couldn't believe that a bunch of kids who don't even know would want to help us. Thanks, guys. Yeah. You know, Mr. Stone, seems to me you got quite an operation here. Looks like you have a real gift for leadership. Uh, well, it's, it, it's not me, really. It, it's these great kids. You know, it's way cool we all work together. It's like Paul describes in 1 Corinthians. We're all a part of the body of Christ. Yep, that's right. Everybody has their own part, just like we were saying about the nose and the ears and the eyes. Everybody has their own role. Because if we were all one thing, we couldn't hear or just sn or smell. I can't. Yeah, that's okay. No. It's fine. It's fine. If your body wall noses, at two. Yeah, for it. We got that loud and clear. So what if I sing, Charlie play the drums, and Sam Blake play the guitar yes. together? Yes. I can't play any instruments, but I bet with a little help from my friends, we can really do a number on this park. Like I said, it's a beautiful thing. Too. In fact, we rocked. 
what if we hit the road together? Certainly, you all noticed. Noticed what, Prudence? Indeed, major rockage. Yeah. You guys remember when I pulled my... You guys remember when I kept my Bible in my guitar case? I keep in there to remind me why I play and who gave me the ability to play. But, uh, why do you mean? But don't you just play because you're awesome at it? I play because God's given me a musical talent, yeah, but I don't pay, play so people will scream and yell for me. Well, I used to, but in the end, I didn't like how it made me feel. I was afraid I'd mess up, and if I messed up, what would they think of me then? What if they stopped screaming and yelling for me? I made it about me, and it isn't. But if God gives us gifts and talents, aren't we supposed to show them? Oh, that's right. I'm ready to shine for the whole world to see. We're supposed to shine, but not to show ourselves. We're supposed to shine to point others to Jesus. Like Taylor over there. She's using her gifts to make new friends and to help others. And to be a good way. To point others to Jesus. She's not doing it to bring attention to herself, but to lead them to the Lord. Jazz, could you read 1 Peter 4.11 from my Bible? I keep it in the, the bookmark in that exact spot. Sure. Sure, Maxie. Let's see. 1 Peter 4.11 says, If anyone speaks, he should do it with the strength God provides, so that in all things God may be praised through Jesus Christ. To him be the power forever and ever. Amen. Whether we're rocking on stage in front of a huge crowd, or even carrying a rock or two. Even everyday things like making new friends, we're showing off the glory of God. 